Andy Murray and Kim Sears began dating in 2006. Djokovic and Yelena in 2005. Nadal and Maria in 2005. And Federer and Mirka in 2000. Do you think that this is a coincidence? Or have their stable relationships been an important factor in their consistency? I don't think this is a coincidence. A key to success on tour is maturity. There is a correlation between your maturity and how much you're willing to commit in a relationship. So I don't think it's a, a coincidence that the big four have all had long-term relationships. Most of these guys have had long-term relationships with many of the people in their teams, their physios, their coaches, their managers, agents, psychologists. Stability is a good thing, but stability takes maturity. And the big four certainly had those things in spades.